So this is for Costco's fiscal second quarter. It does look like a nice beat for earnings per share compared to analyst estimates. Costco turning in two dollars and one cent per share. The street was looking for a dollar sixty nine. Revenues look a little bit light, thirty five point four billion dollars compared to consensus of thirty five point six seven billion dollars. And then comparable sales for the full quarter up five point four percent. The street had been looking for up five point six percent. And remember, Costco does still report those numbers monthly, so we knew all but this final month of February for those numbers. The shares here for Costco up more than two and a half percent. Sarah. All right, Courtney Reagan, thank you. Stephanie Link still with us. Talk about the Costco results. Mike Santoli as well. Getting a pop in the stock on a, a earnings beat and decent comps, right, Stephanie? I mean, to me, I don't know what the margins are, but if they obviously beat on the bottom line and revenues were kind of in line, that means that they're getting operating leverage, and that means that they're seeing better results on the margin side. So I just have to see the results there. But, I mean, this is such a wonderful company, right? They have a niche. They have a great customer base. They have 70% recurring revenue. Membership fees are, are just ter terrific. Traffic is good. The comp number, people would die for that comp number. Yeah. So I, I just feel like the only problem with this name is it trades at 28 times forward estimates. It's expensive, but it is a quality secular grower. It's a compounder, and I think every time I try and trim it, I always regret it. So I just hold on to it, and I just think they're doing a great job. And that 70% of revenues, uh, Stephanie, coming from the membership fees yes. means it is more protected from the, the threats this industry has faced. That's, exact, the last that's exactly right, and that's why it does get that high right, multiple. That's, right? That explains the valuation. Right. Exactly. Part, absolutely. Uh, and keep the company does not give. Um, earnings guidance. So yes, it's a big beat, but I don't think that people necessarily feel like the estimate is, is a tight number to guidance. Just going to hit e-commerce sales up 24%.